Well, I've got a lot of jobs to do up here this weekend. Um, just got done mowing the trails, checked the game cams, everything looked pretty good. They're still doing construction out on the road in front of the place, so um, it's going to be pretty hard to get to the fishing spot that I wanted to get to tomorrow. But I'm going to try real hard to uh, get a video out on that. It's a private lake. I hear there's uh, some pretty big sunfish in there. I don't know. Uh, I'm going to have to drag the kayak in quite a ways uh, to find out. But uh, there's a path from other people doing it, so I'm hoping to be pleasantly surprised. It's a lake that abuts my property that I lease and own. So it's kind of, uh, it's 90% private, except for a 10% a uh, area of, of crown land or federal land, depending on which country you're from, uh, that uh, allows access to it. So should be a good day if we can get in there. But anyway, uh, what I'm gonna do, I'll just give you a look around camp here. It's looking pretty messy right now. I got a lot of stuff disorganized, but this fire pit open area, this is eventually gonna be some garden area. And in the meantime, it's gonna be a parking spot and bonfire area. Eventually though, I'd like to, to have some raised beds in here, maybe in, maybe some grapevines, a pergola, maybe like even some paver bonfire area with paver patio bricks and whatnot. Um, so just give you a look around across the driveway here. Uh, this is going to be the, the shack site. I've been kind of slow on this because I've been changing my mind frequently about the size of the cabin, the position of the cabin, the just all different kinds of things about it. So I'm going to start over again. I'm going to pull all the strings that I started to lay and I'm going to clear some more of these trees out and I'm going to reposition the, the face of the cabin so it's more parallel with the driveway. And unfortunately, I'm gonna to have to cut down a couple of these maple trees, get these logs out of here, and um, general cleanup mostly. If that gets done, we're gonna start on the outhouse pit. Lots of projects. I'm starting the outhouse today, and of course, roots and rocks seems to be the, the theme of the day. But once I get through these roots, it should be pretty easy digging. Then I'm gonna use these uh, boards that are hinged. A buddy of mine gets them at his work, and that's gonna be the interior of the hole to kind of keep the ground from falling in. So I'll check back later. Well, I got through the rocks and the roots, and now it's kind of a hard gravel. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with all the extra dirt, but. Well, that wasn't much fun, but I've got the uh, the box bottom portion done. So now I'm just going to put a lid on it for this weekend and next time I come up I'll build the base and the rest of it. So I think I've pretty well got about as far as I can on the base of the outhouse. I'm going to have to build the rest of it probably at the house and then bring it out here. I'm going to do just a little bit more work leveling it. I think one end is a little deeper than the other. It's literally a shipbox. 